assembly instructions for shunt release. These are the accessories required, tools required, screw driver. Lift the shroud cover, press off push button and open the racking shutter. Rotate the handle anti-clockwise or clockwise in order to unlock it and then remove the handle from cradle. Insert the handle and rotate it in anti-clockwise direction until breaker comes into disconnected position. Slightly push the handle inwards and take out such that racking shutter closes. Then insert the handle back into the cradle. With the help of rail handle, pull out the breaker up to maintenance position and unload the breaker from rail. Remove screws from both sides of the fascia. Now pull down the charging handle halfway and take out the fascia. This is shunt release. This place is assigned for mounting shunt release. Place the shunt release at this slot and slide it backwards to lock against the latch on the top plate. This auxiliary contact needs to be fixed at this slot by slightly pressing it. Remove dummy SICs from C1, C2 and TCS. Click fit the shunt release SICs with appropriate wire number at its respective position. Remove this opaque cover. Turn the fascia upside down. Slightly tap the opaque cover with screwdriver to remove it. Now click fit the transparent cover from outside. Pull down the charging handle halfway and insert the fascia. Refix the screws on both sides of the fascia. This is how the breaker front fascia looks after fixing the shunt release. Now the breaker is ready to mount and rack it inside the cradle.